Today's country in your all time. Country Legends, FM 104.3, Easy Country, and a good afternoon team. Glad you're with us. It's time to you know, visit with a rage. Are you a raging Cajun, Charlie? What are you, man? I'm just a Louisiana boy. Man. Louisiana boy. Yeah, can't go wrong just being a Louisiana boy. You know, boy. there's some famous people from Louisiana, I tell you. Yeah. You know, and one of my favorite songs of all time was Jerry Reed talking about the swamps down there. You remember that, Amos Moses? Oh, yeah. You ever play that in the show or anything? Early, years ago. Did yeah. you? Uh, you know, I played that the other day for one of my, my uh, kids, and they thought, what is that? Yeah. <laughs> but they liked it. I mean, yeah. that's a good sound, but... Uh, I, I tell you another Louisiana boy that came to Nashville did great, uh, Joe Stafford. Oh yeah, yeah. Joe and Mo, Joe, totally Joe is on everybody else. Well, well, yeah, it's, a, thing. It's, a, it's blues and soul yeah. and country all thrown in the same mm -hmm. mix, you know. And it was good. Whew. Yeah. <laughs> tell me that. About it. I eat, right? Yeah. <laughs> there you go. All right, now what are you gonna play for us here? Break one out. Oh, let's do that. We do that. You got, this is Jason. This is right? Jason. Yeah, Jason. This is no Mich Michigan boy. Say hello to your mama. Yeah. yeah, hey, Mama. Morning. <laughs> Good morning, Mama. Yeah. Well, so we got a Cajun and a uh, yeah. Hoosier. And they say, what is that up there? Is that what you all are? Wolverine. No, you're not Hoosiers. You're uh, Wolverines. 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 Yeah. That's it, see? I mean, Wolverines. <laughs> And Cajuns. Let's, there we let's go. Hear it's a it. good mix, man. All right, Charlie. Yeah. <laughs> Tell us what we're doing here. Uh, it's a tune called Alabama Stars. I was just an old Louisiana boy. She was a sweet Georgia peach. First time we met was a hot summer day on an Alabama beach. She had some sexy green eyes, long. She was working on a brown sugar tan. She sparkled like crystal, looking so fine, soaking up all that sunshine. All we lay there just sipping on chills, watching that watch ball disappear every time our eyes met. I say it's gonna be a night we won't forget. And under those Alabama stars were falling fast and hard Laughing and talking in the midnight dark Two bottles of wine with our toes in the sand Love song playing over and over again We found love and gave each other a heart Under those Alabama stars Did you write that song? Yeah. Yeah, sure did. Uh, I know that I've got the CD here and I was looking at it. I think you wrote every one. I wrote every tune on it. She called me a fool, Lord, I never saw it coming. She was my angel, my life, my world, my one and only. You can't make somebody's heart keep loving you, but if I could. I wish I, I wish I had a delete button in my head. There's so much I'd like to delete. You yeah. know, through all the years, all the cover tunes, all the songs, and really all the rewrites, after a while it all starts kind of run together. Yeah, you know, like, what is it? It don't really crash, but it gets a virus. I guess what it gets. I don't know. Get a dump. Yeah. There you go. So do you? I let you get a drink. When you see, do you see something? And I mean, sometimes just. Write a song. I know they always talk about Willie writing on napkins and things like that. You do kind of sing. Yeah, uh, yeah. She'll tell you that, I, <laughs> bro. I've definitely wrote stuff on that. I get it's you know, uh, you get inspired. Things, certain things hit you. You hear something. Sometimes someone will be talking. They'll be passionately talking, and they'll throw a hook out. It's just a word or two to them. Uh -huh. but, but they, somebody, nobody hears what I hear, and I'm like, oh, man, there's there a song is. in that. And then my mind, it goes to working, so I, I just start writing it all down. And then I, I love to get a half a verse, and the whole course, and that's it. And then I'll go home and think about it a little while and write it, and then it allowed to be a rewrite, and, you know, and then play around they with it. music to it. Yeah. They come in the strangest, the strangest ways. Uh, <laughs> I, I've got one wrote. I told him, uh, I woke up with this. Who you kissing now? Give it all your love to. Now, I didn't actually sing that, but I heard, and I thought, whoa, I like that melody. Yeah. So I found though, I found that that what I was doing and, and uh, wrote the tune, and we, uh, we've already cut it. Uh, I like amazing. it. Amazing. Yeah. I love songwriting. It's, uh, 
as therapy to me. Uh, it gets any any and everything out of me. Everybody does different. Some people hunt. I used to hunt. I uh, can't do a lot of that anymore. I've had back surgery, shoulder surgery. I can't shoot. So I, I'm cool with it. Go kill all the bambies and bucks you want. I don't care. I'm cool with that. Hank, get in there and shoot them. Uh, leave it Ted Nugent, y'all get yeah. after it. I'm cool with it. Ted. Yeah, I just, but I'm more into get, to, for therapy for me, or uh, just, just to write. And there's things in your life that happen. I told the guys uh, when we, when my sister got killed in a motorcycle accident in July. It was a hit and run. It was a horrible thing, and it affected me big time. Matter of fact, I told the guys, you know, I don't know if I can keep doing this, you know, right now. But you know, after being away from it, and I know what she'd want me to do. She's my biggest fan. So when we got back together, I said, we'd do every song on that CD except Southern Girls, because she inspired part of that song. Yeah. And uh, so we, we fixed it, you know, they already know it. I just couldn't sing it without breaking up. And it just brought so many emotions that I didn't want to go there. It put me back in the funeral, because they played it at it. And it's like, oh, you know, when things like that happen at the time, it seems real cool. We'll, we'll do this at the funeral, but it might, it would throw me back at that funeral yeah. every time. But I'm, I'm past that now, and we're able to do it. But the songs is just, uh, you know, as much as they come, things can happen in your life where I was dry. Like, for I didn't really care if I wrote a song or whatever for about two and a half months. She'll tell you I didn't. I didn't play my guitar. I didn't do hardly anything. You know, but I, I, I'll never get over it, but I can, you yeah, know, move on. I can move on. You know, I can make her proud by, you know, uh, you know singing that song. And it's not just her. She's a Southern girl. My daughters are Southern girls. And, you know, John's wife. One and hey, man, I done found out something. I got some. I got some girls on uh, Facebook. You know, they're just kids. You know, but they Southern girls. They know that man. They like riding four wheelers. They like cane poles and mud running through their toes. I mean, because I mean, you know, yeah. you know, they love the song. They download it and they bought it and it's cool. You know, they from Chicago, but they Southern girl. Look, you can be hey. Chicago's in the north, unless you're there, there's something north above you, so that makes you the south. That makes you, you the south, what that's right. There so, you go. <laughs> I don't know if we ever play the North Pole. I don't know what we're going to do, but I'll figure out yeah, something. You, you work yeah. something out there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Charlie, it's been a pleasure, buddy. Hey, brother, I appreciate the opportunity. I think uh, John Freak, I, yeah. I, uh, and look, everybody come out and hear us at Eddie Montgomery's, and we're going to be working this area in some, uh, later on in the summer. And uh, if we do a show up here, let us come back through here and promote it. You can come right back. Kind of put you on the spot. Anytime. Like, no, you're not putting us on the spot. Probably when we go off the air, he's going to say, hey, dude, you ain't never coming back. <laughs> <in here."> <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not. You're yeah. welcome anytime. Yeah. Uh, and you do sound like Carl Bamberg back home. Carl Bamberg. Yeah. 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 Okay. Right. Carl Bamberg. Yeah. I'll have to call Carl up. That's, yeah. 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 He's uh, what's the call letters, baby, back home? <laughs> KJLO. Yeah, KJLO. Oh, Carl we'll Bamberg. Is it Baton Rouge or? Monroe, Louisiana. Monroe. That's my hometown. Not yeah. West Monroe, Monroe, Louisiana. That's I guess you're uh, for the Cats this weekend taking on LSU, huh? <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> you cut me. If I'm leaving Tiger, man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we'll let you come back if you say go Cats. How's that? Yeah, go Cats. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> That'll work. Charlie, it's been a pleasure. And yeah. uh, Jason. Jason Ryan, Hampton, yeah. Jason, good and, job yeah. on the guitar, you know. Yeah. And uh, yeah. check them out Facebook. Go over there. And it's Charlie. Uh, Wood. Charliewoodmusic.com. Yeah. Yeah. Can get you. Then Same on way, Facebook, it's Charlie way. Wood. Yeah. Okay. Charlie. Don't get me confused with that cat out of Memphis, which I love. There's yeah. another Charlie Wood yeah. blues, blues jazz dude. Yeah. I'm plugging you, dude, so plug me when you get a chance. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for coming by. All right. Okay.